Hi everyone, Angela Benedict here from the Military Healing Center with a quick webinar for you about creating lasting change. We've all heard the saying, you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. Well, the same, unfortunately, is very true with people. You are on the right track if you're looking for ways to make change stick, whether it's for yourself or your business, organization, agency, department. You've likely recognized, as I have, that you need a process to follow to get results. As a coach, trainer, and program designer, I take large amounts of information, break it down into actionable, manageable steps to take to get people from where they are to where they want to be. I do the heavy lifting and say, okay, here you go, do these things. From there, it should be a simple process, right? Normally, no. Because predominantly, people don't just need the steps to take. They need the motivation to take them. Now, for a long time, we called this willpower. Willpower, or mental toughness, as it is called in some circles, will absolutely get you through a lot of things, but it runs out eventually. Especially when people are seeing the same kinds of events, circumstances, conditions, repeatedly cycling through their lives over and over. They try to tough it out, and it works for a while. Then the same things happen again, and they may begin to feel really frustrated, overwhelmed, and even despairing. What do you have to do to get change to stick? I provide coaching to two groups of people, military, law enforcement, security professionals, and everybody else. Because my first group has some big time issues going on that cause them a lot of pain, I had to become very good at finding solutions fast. Here's what I think you should know. Number one, mental mastery is more than mental toughness, and it is critically important to your success. Number two, anxiety has many causes but ultimately makes everyone feel exactly the same way. Powerless, and that has an antidote. And number three, what you believe to be true will be. Let me explain that last point in a little more depth. What we believe determines 100% of our behaviors, which determine our outcomes. This is a mechanism. It works the same every time. Knowing how to leverage this mechanism so it is working for you, not against you, is critically important. Most of the people I work with aren't notoriously skeptical of most things. They are walk around in it, touch it, smell it, then they won't believe it kind of people. They don't do fluffy and abstract well. They are also overwhelmingly determined to be better at most things. So they are always on the lookout for the fastest, simplest to integrate, will get the best results next best thing. The reason I have become an advisor on military performance is because I have gotten really good at handing them results driven tactics. What you want is a way to do what you have to do better. Why? Because you have a lot to do. Productivity matters to you. You want to be more, have more, be able to give more. Operational effectiveness, readiness, resiliency, badass. Okay, maybe that's not entirely you. Or maybe it is, and you need the steps and a way to make those steps stick. I can help you in a couple of ways, but before I tell you what I can offer you, I need to let you know that, one, if you have no inclination to become a better version of yourself, or two, you aren't willing to invest a small amount of money and a larger amount of effort into doing the work, then this process isn't going to be for you. Being an effective badass requires some effort on your part. It doesn't just happen, but it happens a lot sooner and easier when you have a plan. There was a time in my life when I would have given a lot to have someone like me now leading me to a better place. Coming out of a very dysfunctional family system, I learned about chronic stress and bad beliefs the hard way. By the time I was 15, I had diagnosed anxiety, and by 22, had a serious autoimmune disease. My body was giving up. It would be nice to say that my life leveled out and I was given all I needed to heal up quickly and well, but that's not how the story unfolded, and there was a lot more heartbreak, illness, and darkness to follow. So how did I get to be a successful business owner, possessing multiple university degrees, who trains the best of the best? There are four things that Navy SEALs, and I, know work really well if you do them correctly. This holds true for all elite forces. Are you ready? Number one, goal setting. What do you want, and do you believe you can have it? Number two, visualization. Mental rehearsal that activates the powerhouse of your subconscious mind. Number three, self-talk. Mental mastery and creating your experience based on intelligent direction. 
Number four, arousal control, maintaining health and wellness regardless of the situation. You may be looking for a pathway. I have made that process easy and fast. If you are interested in performance optimization in any area of your life, this is for you. How can you work with me? First way is having a personalized coaching session. In a one-on-one, -on -one, just like working with a personal fitness trainer, I lay out the steps for you and with you. I also work with you on creating the best possible supporting belief systems. Our beliefs are responsible for 100% of our behaviors, which determine our outcomes. You need steps that stick. This is a big slide. The second way you can work with me is, you can use the self-contained training program I designed for deployed military personnel who needed a discreet way to learn dial-down strategies that help them stay level and re-energize. This is called the MBV program. If 84% of your workforce significantly improved their operational effectiveness in less than four weeks, how would that affect your overall organization? That was just one of the outstanding results of the MBV program when it was piloted in a joint Canadian-US police stress study. And you can use it too. The third way is through in-class training seminars. My signature program, Tactical Trauma Self-Care Training, although developed for security professionals, can be modified for any group. Learn how to mitigate anxiety in physical, mental, emotional, social, and operational organizational domains. Something to learn here for everyone in this training. Be better, be stronger for longer. If you are a security client and you want more information and to connect with me, go to militaryhealingcenter.net. Go to the register page and click on the training, product, or solution that you think will serve you best. For non-security clients, send an email to benidian1 at gmail.com with I want my coach in the subject line. Thank you for taking the time out to watch this. Stay safe, be well, my best to you.